Hello everyone, hope you're all okay. Right, welcome to day 23 of 31 days of easy peasy painty papers. Now today, I've, I've just done this one. This is combining days four, five and nine. Uh, four was we used a round sponge. Five was corrugated card, different corrugated cards that you can get from packaging and such like things ripping boxes to pieces and nine was veg nets these sort of veg net blah, blah, fruit and veg nets i think that one was from i don't know kiwi fruits or something that one i believe was off of a box of oranges and that one was lemons but you we all get these don't we um yeah, so that's that's what I've done on there, combination of, and I haven't gone heavy handed with the round sponges that I could do if I wanted to, but it's just, you know, it's just getting paint on paper again. You can see, um, but anyway, I thought I would turn that over and do the other side of it. Let's have a look. Uh, so I've, I'm using, I've got, let me got bubblegum pink down just going to put another little bit of I never try and plan colours or anything like that I just pick them up and do it this one sea breeze gain all just my cheap paints this one's got a lot in it but it didn't want to come out oh there we go um, what else have I used baby blue the Americana baby blue oh it's getting really dark now so i'm doing this video straight after yesterday so uh, i used a bit of electric blue it doesn't want to come out either yep and then it comes out in a great big splodge and the americana lavender they're the colours I used on the other side and I've put far too much paint of everything down. Uh, well, we'll just we'll just go for it, shall we? We'll use that sponge. I think I used this will probably be totally different on this side, but because I'm gonna do bigger circles, I think. Uh, not bigger circles, press down more. I didn't. I used the light blue on the other side. Oh, I just love circles. I just can't help it. I just love them. If you don't want to use a round sponge, use whatever sponge you've got. I think I got these from the scrap store. I think, I think, I can't remember. Uh, right, now the netting... <laughs> <laughs> where's it gone I thought oh what can I use and I used this green one and it didn't work brilliantly but I thought what can I use to make like a little pad and I've got this I have all sorts in my craft room this um, dental floss that I used to sew signatures in journals with so I just wrap that round there I didn't want a permanent one because I like to use this on jelly plate and thing. I've still got some paint on there. So I just, oh, it's a bit dry. And this might come out in splodges now because, oh no, it's not too bad. Yeah, I mean, you could even, you know, if you've got an open net. It's quite an open net. Put it down like that and dab paint through it. Use it as like a, a stencil. But I'm using it like this today. Oh, it's pretty just like that. That's that. Uh, corrugated card. Let's have a look. 
Where is my big piece gone? Oh, that's the piece I used. I think I used, yeah, I used the dark blue. I use dark blue and light blue. it over if you want to you don't have to do just gives it a bit of a different look I think I like this side better than the other side there and then I decided I think the last colour I put on was the pink and I just went just gonna look at the stage of my fingers <laughs> yeah love it um, use the thinner, narrower lines. How lovely is that? We really, we really, really, really don't need expensive tools. Just things we, everyday things we can you know, it's just junk, basically. A lot of this, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, even Mr. Doodle, bless him, when we go... Well, back in the day when we used to go to shops, <laughs> you know, like a couple of years ago, <laughs> when we were allowed out and we could go shopping, you know, those shops that you used to go in, you know, you can remember... <laughs> Back in 2019, those big buildings and they sell food and that, that we used to be allowed to walk round them and like sensible people. Anyway, that's enough silliness. Um, yeah, he, even he, he'll go round the shop say, and look, especially like on the fruit and veg, is this any good? Is this any good? And oh, there's a nice bit of brown paper there, look. <laughs> or whatever sticky labels off of things and you know all bits and bobs that are just thrown out in the store there that'll do for that one I think So we got the corrugated card, round sponge and the fruit netting on that one and that's the other side. I'll just hang that up on my little line. Oops, it's just fallen straight on the floor. Oh, it can stop there now. I can't be bending down. I'm too old to bend down. No, I'm not. <laughs> I'm just lazy. I was so wet so it won't mop the carpet. Oh dear. Runny old nose. Um the corrugated card, right, let's do it, shall we? The corrugated card uh, you could cut a circle out. Right, let's use a new bit. Where's my scissors gone? Just cut a circle or a heart or whatever, whatever shape you want. If you don't think you can cut a circle to your liking, then draw a, you know, draw the shape first. Cut that bit off there, and you could always stick a a lid or something on the top or another piece of card to make like a little handle if you wanted to right what colors shall we still work with these colors yeah i think we will we'll work with these colors again because they're pretty well all colors are pretty aren't they uh, that blue down that blue that blue you know that blue that's actually sea green sea breeze
I can make little oh we can see that this is going to be a repeat pattern one And we do another colour the other way on top of it, but I need some more green down. Move my scissors out the way. Oh, I've really had such a lot of fun doing this series. I'm so pleased I did it. It's not, you know, I'm not, I don't know whether I come across as confident or not to people that watch me, but I'm I'm not. <laughs> you know, I don't, I'm not a confident person, although I think I, I have got better. I mean, good God, I'm nearly 62. I should have a bit of confidence now. <laughs> um, but, you know, it's this is obviously just something that I feel confident enough to do, but... Yeah, we're going off of circles a bit now, but just dobbing it down. But yeah, I, I am really pleased that I've done it because I've enjoyed it and it's just, you know, the way the world is at the minute. We need something to... Something fun, don't we? Right, so if you just wanted circles, then you would just do it like that. But that's nice to me. Uh, where's the purple gone? There it is. Come on, purple now. Loving. Oh. Well, that's just come out like water. So we won't use that bit. wonder why that is when I've just used it a few minutes ago. I don't know. Oh, it has done there as well. I wonder why that's happening. So that's a, a good make of... don't know why that is. We'll mix it in with my finger. That's not too bad. I always store them upside down. So that it will come out better. But that doesn't always work, does it? Right, I'm not bothering about covering all of the... Oh, look at that. Isn't that pretty? Uh, where are we? Ah, that way. Oh, yes. <laughs> I love it. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, that's so pretty. What gets you excited in the crafting world? What, what, you know, I think I probably asked you this in a previous video. Oh, I'll ask you again because more different people might be watching this one. But, you know, what makes you go, oh God, I really love that so much. Or don't you get excitement like that? <laughs> And if you don't, then you should do. We should all get excitement like that. It's all pretty colours, does it, for me. Oh, look. Oh, I just... Oh, I don't even know whether to just leave that. I'm just... Oh, no, I think we're going to have pink. We're going to have pink on here. Yes. Pink. Pink, this bubblegum pink again. Or shall I go for a different pink? Hmm, what's this one? Bright pink. Shall we go for that one? This is the hobby craft one. We'll go for a bright pink. Is there a paint glopping? No, not really. Oh, pardon me. So we'll just do bright pink. 
We're not doing any, we're not doing netting on this one. <laughs> Quite clearly, it's just corrugated card. Sorry about that when I'm supposed to be combining them, but never mind, eh? <laughs> oh, yes, please. Look at that. Oh, I do say. How gorgeous is that? <laughs> yeah, I completely forgotten that <laughs> I said I was doing three things. Never mind. It's two things because it's corrugated. Well, I got so carried away there, I didn't realise that I'd stopped recording because I'd run out of storage. I've never, ever had that before, but I just looked at the camera and said, storage full, <laughs> I need to delete some stuff. So, but I was just getting really excited about this and saying that I'm supposed to be doing three things and I've only done the one, the, the corrugated card on that side. So I'm going to turn it over. Oh, that was funny. I'm going to turn it over and we'll do some, <laughs> some lavender sponging <laughs> again. <laughs> And I was on 15 or 16 minutes, I think it was. Doesn't time fly when you're having fun? Right, so that's the sponge. And then we want corrugated card. I've got the um, bright pink, that one. Bright pink down. Oh, now let's do the... Do some nets, shall we? Ooh, I've got green on there. No, I don't want that. What else can I use? Yeah, we'll use this bit of net. Use some of this, see how that works. What can I put underneath? Just to make like a little... Oh, so see if that'll work. <laughs> I've got a packet of toothpicks that I use to do my beads with. Just wrap that round there. See if we can make like a little stamp with that. Spread that paint out a bit. I don't think you can see me, can you? What I'm doing over here. Just spreading that out a bit. Again, you could fasten some of the net into a piece of card or something like that. Oh, this is just going to be a great big splotch. Oh, it's not too bad. Oh, that's nice. Nice bit of texture there, look. Not thinking about it, just dubbing it down. And then we'll have the mint green sea breeze, whatever it's called. nice that is with the um, corrugated card should we have the thin one I'm still recording I'm going to be paranoid now oh that's pretty Did I have on the other side? Oh, no, same, same colours, is it? Yeah. round piece haven't we shall we just have a bit of baby blue on this side shall we let's have a look see how that works out Going in 
There's a circle, but never mind. Leave that one like that. I better get a move on and so I've got these two clips to stitch together now. <laughs> If it'll let me, if iMovie will let me. I do, I do love my iPhone, but that's the first time it's ever told me that I've run out of storage. But I've still got, because I'm doing the videos in advance, I have uploaded them to YouTube, but I would forgot to delete them from my phone. Oh, that's pretty lot. Oopsie. Yeah. Right, my lovelies, that will do for today. <laughs> All we've done is two sheets. <laughs> 20 minutes, two sheets. But it's double-sided, so... Yeah. Oh, I think I was saying, um, before I got cut off... Well, no, after I got cut off, wouldn't it be? Because <laughs> um, you wouldn't hear me. But I think I was saying that, um, oh, please forgive me for not doing three things on there. And if, if you don't forgive me, then I'll just have to live with it. <laughs> I was just having a silly moment. Anyway, that's what we've done with day four, day five, day five, uh, day nine round sponge, corrugated card and fruit and veg net. So I hope you've still enjoyed, even though it's a bit of a, yeah, in your face, but I, it's not in your face to me. I just, what I love that sort of thing. But anyway, take care. Speak to you soon. Bye.